Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, today we are doing a commentary over how what we think of uh, video games that are out and about nowadays and what's coming out in the later year. So, um... I think, to start off, um, I want to say that I think 2021 and 2020, uh, 2022 have probably been the best years we've had of gaming in a long while. Uh, I would say 2022 has been. I wouldn't say 2021. Dude, do you know what the top the top game of 2021 was? What was it? It takes two. No way. It was. It was the top game of 2020, uh, 2021. Bro, that was such a good game, though. And I'm saying, so that's the reason why I'm saying 2021 was a good year for games. It's, it's just like, to include, okay, we have, uh, I think Red Dead came out the very beginning of the year. Or late 20. Yeah, Red Dead 2. Um, we had, like, um... What was it? We had Red Dead 2, Halo Infinite came out in the later end of the year. We have, I don't really consider Call of Duty. Call of Duty and Battlefield 1 kind of, or Battlefield, kind of failed. See, it, it's the, the, the big box games that came out. Like, all the all the games that uh, the AAA companies released, they all flopped so hard. Halo didn't. I like Halo, and I still enjoy, like, Halo. I'm just waiting for, I, I'm I, waiting for the, I'm waiting for the campaign to be co-op. Literally I, all I'm waiting for. I enjoyed Halo Infinite, um, but I didn't enjoy. I, I maybe it's just because I got too used to faster time to kills. Yeah. I just didn't like the time to kill in that game, and I, yeah. my aim was way too bad. Um, and then Last of Us, Last of Us Two came out. Yeah, The Last of Us Two. You know, I never played The Last of Us One, but um, it, it looked like a good game. game. Um. Well, no, I take that back. I did play the first one. I, I haven't played the second one yet, though. Um, the first one, I loved the story. First one, you love the story. The story in the first one was really good. Uh, the story in, in the environment, it was just so immersive. Valheim came out, which was kind of like a, it was the Amazon uh, open world thing. That one, I tried to play. Um, Isaiah bought it for me. Oh yeah. Yeah, how was that? It uh, wouldn't run. Oh. So I can't. I don't have any good commentary on that one. And then to include some of the more popular games of 2021 were like Minecraft, obviously, Counter Strike, um, Apex. Apex is a good game. It didn't come out in 2021, but it was still a really good game to see. Yeah, I mean, I I think they improved it a lot during 2021. But um, what I'm trying to say is like, what are the games that are coming out later this year? Oh okay, wait, so um. Probably like the most awaited one would have to be Breath of the Wild. You think so? Everybody's, I mean, like, Breath of the Wild was like the game whenever it came out, right? Like, anybody who had. So you're telling game, me that Elden Ring wasn't a good game this year? Elden Ring has already been released. Yeah, but is it is it a good game? No, Elden Ring is so fucking amazing. I suck ass at it. I don't know where this. I don't know how to progress in the game. I can't find any of the dungeons, but it's because I don't put the time required for the game. Like if I if I were to put more time into it, then I'm sure I would love it even more. But from what I've played, it's it's one of my favorite games that I've ever played. And then um, one of the flops of this year so far, Rainbow Six Extraction does not need to be a game. No, Rainbow Six Extraction is literally just Operation. It's just Operation Hell. I thought it was called Operation yeah. Extraction. Is that that's the one where Finca was released, right? Yeah, yeah. Finca and yeah. um, the, L Leon Lion. <clears throat> um, then later this year, Uncharted is coming out. Legacy of Thieves. We're not PlayStation PlayStation players, but I've always loved the Uncharted series. Yeah. Uh, and then we got some bangers for Pokemon games. Hold on, hold on. Excuse me. What? Pokemon. Dude, the, like the like just watching Pokemon is amazing. A lot of things I, came out of the Pokemon series. I, I I liked Pokemon when I was a kid. I can't play it now. I, I don't know why. It's just like I'm sure if I picked up a Pokemon game, I would enjoy it. But like, it, it's just. I I wish it was more. Um, like. A, a, a video game nowadays then like they just seem to update the graphics every single time yeah but it, it, I, I just think I think it's an interesting game 
Um, let's see. What else? What other games are coming out this year? Let's see. Uh, Ragnarok is coming out. Uh, God of War Ragnarok. Oh, I'm excited about that. I can't wait to see the gameplay for that. Bro, I, I absolutely loved um watching like all of the cutscenes and shit from the god of war series mm -hmm. hearing about the lore is just so cool um but yeah no even as that like i think like these past years have been really good for game gamers i mean a lot of games that are coming out even the ones that we don't even talk about like obviously there's been like a few that like come out in recent years that we've loved um but I think I think like overall I think we're in a good state of games. I mean, uh, at the moment our main thing is Apex. So I mean that's what we've been playing. We have Minecraft. I we're playing a few other so older mad. games. All right. I, I got so mad at Stormpoint, man. Oh yeah. They need to take that map out of rotation. They need to update it. They need to fix the map and then put it back in. Um, GTA Five is coming. Came out on the next gen consoles. You see that? GTA 5 is out again? Yeah, it's out on the new gen consoles. Oh, I figured that, uh, I figured they would have already released it. It's more so they just updated all the graphics and all the things that you, like, there's something, like, new things that look better in the game, like explosions and, like, certain aspects of, like, shooting glass and shit. I don't know, there's more things inside of it. I haven't really had to play it because I don't have a new gen console. I really want to get one, but it is what it is. It is what it is. There's a, there's a new, um... A new Splatoon coming out. Did you hear about that? Not really big into Splatoon. Sad yeah, to say. I'm not either. Uh, I I was just looking at it. I figured it would be something to talk about. Uh, a lot Frankly, of people are a lot of people are hyped about uh, Tina uh, Tiny Tina's Wonderland on Borderlands Three. Um, the the D and D one. Yeah, 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 the D and D one. Bro, I I love that on Borderlands Two. Oh yeah, no, I played the hell out of that. It was a really good one. Bro, they're uh they're releasing a new Sonic game too. Releasing a Sonic game? Yeah, Sonic Frontiers. It's supposed to be similar to Sonic 06. Oh god. Yeah. <laughs> they're they're talking about they're making a new Diablo game. A new Diablo? No. Yeah, way. called Diablo Immortal. And they're making a new Cuphead. Maybe we can actually play this one. Oh, I hope. Bro. That that made me so mad whenever we, I figured out it. You had it was only couch play. Yeah, and that makes me really sad that it was not, like, actual, like, co-op. I think there's a way of getting around it. On PC? On PC. On PC, it is. But oh, not... Okay. Yeah. But, I mean, overall, I think, um, games this year have been really good. We've been spoiled a little bit. We're gonna have, like, some good games come out later this year as well. Um, I like how it is. Like, I, I'm enjoying Apex because it's, like, the main thing that we play. I've been really enjoying it. I understand a lot of people are having problems with their ranks or... Um, like they have like minor details that they don't like, especially Stormpoint. But I feel like it's we're in a good location for gaming games right now. Uh, I I do I, I do like the uh, the the outlook on games. However, I I was pretty disappointed last year. Yeah, but disappointing flops. Battlefield uh, Battlefield the new one. Big flop. Really oh, wish to 2042. Flop. Wish it was better. Really wish it was better. I, I wish they should have just re-released Battlefield 3. Um, what was it? Uh, Vanguard was not even interested in it. Really, there was no reason for them to make it. I'm happy that um, Xbox bought it, and there's no probably gonna be better games now. Give us Call of Duty Ghost 2. I need to finish that story, man. Uh, stop! Stop blue balling us, Microsoft. Now that you have it. <laughs> Um, but no, I think overall, I think we were in a good time. I mean, it'll probably get better throughout the year. I can't wait for the new story mo uh, story ones to come out. Um, I think that'll be a big improvement for us, uh, for like the whole gaming community, and it'll probably make a uh, couple months of content. Hopefully, we got a we got a um, a good some more games that we've been playing is total. Ba uh, uh, we've been playing crab game, pretty meme game. That was crab pretty game, pretty fucking fun. Pretty fun overall. Uh, CSGO was good. I'm enjoying that. Just don't start it, even though it's an older game. But yeah, guys, if you actually do enjoy this content, don't forget to like and subscribe. And uh, you know, just hit us up on anything that you want to see.